Hello, peoples of whatever country you are. Well, U.S. because that's like where all my viewers are from. I am playing Animal Crossing today, even though nobody asked. So, yes. Good afternoon. We're so excited to have you here. Have you here? Oh my god. Let us be the first to congratulate you on your wise decision to sign up for this adventure. Welcome to the check counter for your desert deserted island getaway package. There's so much to look forward to, but first let us introduce ourselves. I'm Timmy with Nook Inc. And I'm Tommy. God, I hate that voice. The first step is checking your application. This is your first time applying for one of our packages? Yes. Understood. Stood. Stood. Now then, we'll need to look up your application. Can we have your name and birthday? Birthday? Cool. Alright. Spade. Spade. Let's see. Oh, yes. Here you are. Our next I'm gonna stop with the voices. Our next step will be to take a picture of you, Spade. Oh, don't worry. Take as much time as you need to get yourself looking just the way you want. Uh, I guess... I'll do boy. I like my, uh, sailor suit. Well, yeah, I guess the hair is not even close, but... Now let's start talking about your new home. So exciting. Exciting. Okay. Just hemisphere stuff. North America. South America. Not North America. Not that they're approximately the same size and they're all quite natural, so don't worry about whether you have enough space or comfort, you can't go wrong. But like, what if just half the island is water? I'll show you some maps now. Hmm. I like the island in the middle of this one. We could like put something there. I don't know. A building. Seems useful. Wonderful choice. I can't wait to show it off to you. Uh, but before we depart, I have just one final question for you. If you bring one thing, is there anywhere to be? The sleeping bag? Yeah. How interesting. Wait, was I not gonna get any of the other stuff? Oh, hypothetical. Ah, uh, ah, uh, okay. Ha, ha, ha. Funny. We are departing. Tired flight from Nook Inc's Third Island Getaway Package is ready for boarding. Any customers waiting to board should make their way to the gate at this time. Come on, let's all board the plane together. Aw, like, like friends. Hello, everyone. Thank you for taking this chartered flight as part of Nook Inc's Third Island Getaway Package. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy a complimentary video present- Oh no, is this like... Uh... Welcome to Animal Crossing, folks. We know we're not gonna watch this whole thing, right? Alright, hopefully I don't get totally garbage villagers, but we all know. What's gonna happen here? Oh. Uh. Okay, well, they're not bad. No, you must be incredibly excited to explore your new island home, but I have one small request. Would you please join us for an orientation session nearby the plaza? Sure, yeah. Fearless leader? I wonder who that is. Oh. I wanna see this guy's face. You're so adorable! Oh, well, look at you. Teddy and Renee. So what color is my ear? Yellow! Let's go. 
best color. Alright, is that everyone? Let's see. Is Renee here? Hi. How about Teddy? Beautiful. And there's Spade, of course. Yes. Great. We're all here. I'll turn it over to you, Mr. Nook. Our three adventurers are ready to get started. Yes, yes, very good. Let's see, how shall I begin? I really need to stop doing accents. It's of course welcome, everyone, and welcome to your new island. Okay, I was expecting there to be more of that sentence. My name is Tom Nook, and I'm the founder of the pr and president of Nook Inc. Yes, yes, why do they just say yes once? Today is the first day of your new life on this pristine, lovely island, so congratulations. And this is a package deal. Hmm. As such, Nink Nink Nook Inc. staff will always be here to support you and ensure your comfort and safety. But, first things first. Yes, yes. I'd like each of you to choose a spot of your own. It's the first step to putting down some real roots. I'd like you to dream big. I do have certain connections in construction and real estate, and... Ah, but I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's just get started with a simple tent, shall we? Please collect your tent from Timmy or Tommy. Oh, look at you with your little flag. Here you go, Spade. Very own tent. Cool. Oh, map. That is probably helpful. This looks like a nice spot to put up a tent. I don't... It's too close to the water. Oh! Wait. Well, that's like the perfect distance to the water. Yes! Oh, that's a great spot. I set up my tent. That's a big first step. Yeah, it is. Um, I saw Teddy, so we'll go find him. There you go. Whee. Okay, you're right there, too. Hey. Yep. Cardio? Oh, are you a job? I'll find you a good spot. Yeah. I want to have some nice, like, by the river spots for homes. Plaza. Visualizing how awesome. I just need to move in a straight line. There. Alright, let's see. Yep. Beautiful. Yeah. Alright. May you were like over here. Renee. Oh yeah, cause like nay, cause like she's a horse. Feel for the best spot. Okay. Uh, throw a stick. I can find you a spot. Yeah, I'm just a good person like that. Right, so here, right? Just ba. Ba. Here. Just like a good spot. I don't know. Let's see. Too close, alright. Here? Maybe we think it. I need to get a little closer. Too close, alright. A little more this way. Oh? Oh, look at that! Beautiful. Renee got a place. Alright. Let's go back to the plaza. Oh, 
Oh. Alright, welcome back everyone. I hope you all found just the right spot to set up your new homes. Of course, you can sleep on it for a while, hmm? Really get a feel for how it suits you. And with that taken care of, we can move on to more serious business. Like throwing in that- how is that more serious than like having a place to live? Let's see. Timmy, Renee, Tommy, and Teddy, you can set up things in the closet. So like everyone except for me and you. Are we gonna duke it out or something? What's up, man? Ah, Spade, I just wanted to go over what we'll need for the campfire. Ten tree branches. Right. So when you find them lying on the ground, just press Y to pick it up. Apple-like items. I suspect they're real apples. Wow, what a revelation. You go, man. Nice. Alright. Tom Nook, I am back. Trust you had some success foraging for tree branches. Yes, very well. Let me to lighten your load. Yes, that should be plenty for a campfire. That one singular one that you just handed me. While you were collecting branches, I was valuing the fruit that seems to be abundant here. They look like apples, they smell like apples, and they even taste like apples. What are you going to say next? They're not apples? In fact, they're 100% without a doubt genuine apples. Well, we're going to have fun. Well, well, I knew you were the right one for the job. Thank you once again. I'll go ahead and take those apples off your hands and get started on the preparations. Okay. It's so easy. Now, is that everything? Yes, yes, I believe it is. Let's go started with all the festivities. Oh boy, great, he knows how to start a fire. At last, allow me to properly welcome you to your new island. I've participated in many ventures and endeavors over the years, but this may be the most exciting. What is that stance? Now, we may not have the kind of numbers I originally envisioned, but that just means we'll have to rise to the challenge. And I have no doubt, doubt that with hard work and perseverance we'll shape that this deserted island into. I suppose we can't call this a deserted island anymore, hmm? What should we call it? Bing bong. It seems a great uh, I sense a great opportunity. Uh, as the first residents of this island, we should be the ones to name it. And, in the spirit of democracy, we should put it to a vote. Majority rules, hmm? So, take a little time to think, and when everyone is ready, I'll present your ideas. So, listen. I know how an- that's an F. I know how Animal Crossing works. So, I already know the perfect name for this island. Oh, did I double click that? I present to you. Debt hole. Let's try saying our ideas at the same time. Ready? Go! Buffberg. What a splendid variety. Yes, yes, each one a potential gem. Now for the voting. I'll say each name in order and you can clap for the one you think is best. Spade seems to have the enthusiasm and naming sensibilities. Let's start there. So Spade suggested... Debt hole. Oh wow. <laughs> yep. They all know. Splendid. Then from now on, this island will be known as Debt Hole. Well, Spade, since you've proven yourself by naming Debt Hole, I'd like to rely on you for other critical decisions we'll need to make on this island. Yes, yes, I hereby name you the resident representative of Debt Hole. Then, without further ado, a toast to Debt Hole and the happiness of its residents. You can just tell how happy they're going to be from that name. Alright. He's got- oh my gosh, you are my new favorite. I- I want to hug you. This guy looks like me in real life, not gonna lie. Yeah, you go, man. You beautiful bear. Hi, Tommy. Oh. 
Oops, you're a slave here too. Let's see. Ah, Spade, having a good time, yes? I know this is a bit much, so if you feel like taking a short nap in your tent, by all means, go ahead. We'll keep the fire burning. Maybe I'll go do that. Oh. It's your very own camping car. Oh, and there are a few packages waiting in your tent. So, like, in that folded tent, there was just... Objects. Okay. It's all for now. Sweet dreams, Spade. Thank you. Oh. Nice. What do we got here? A radio. A lamp. Oh. Oh. Nice. I like the colors. Purple and yellow. What I would say are cha is my channel colors, but don't really have those right now, so what they would be. Rest my head for a little while. Rest. I'm getting sleepy. Sleepy. Oh. So, looks like you've decided to make your own way into the world. Get out there, explore new frontiers. That's all the way right, daddy-o. See, you a hippie? You don't need to live by anyone's rules, but you're the world is made for exploring, you know? Yeah, you're definitely a hippie. Yeah. I take it from the cat who's been on the road, but being your lonesome can grind on the soul. This is rhyming. Also, you're a dog. Where are you? You've got to make friends along the way. Rambling this crazy world is Squareville without some pals. Square? Uh, you... You're not making sense, cat. Maybe it's about time for you to wake up to your new life. Okay, but listen up. That rap I just gave about friends, it's pretty key. You'll dig this island life a whole lot more if you share it with some friends. If that's what you're seeing. It's definitely rhyming. Yeah, an island paradise with your best pals sounds pretty groovy to me. Cool. When you wake up, you'll be in sync with real time. Oh, stop breaking the fourth wall. Spade! Are you in there? Oh, I hope I haven't woken you abruptly. This music might. Ah, uh, but I do wish to discuss something with you. Yes, yes. I'll be here when you're ready. Oh. Ah, uh, there you are. I hope you had a pleasant nap. Or, well, I suppose it was a bit more than a nap, wasn't it? It's a brand new day. I did need that. Oh ho ho, yes, it's quite normal to be worn out from such a long trip and a major life event. Speaking of which, I have a few more things that you might find useful as you adjust to your life in our little paradise called Debt Hole. First, you'll need one of these, yes? Oh, a phone. It's your very own Nook phone. I had these made especially for our island residents. Good, good. Looks like you're getting a good reception as well. From where? Okay, feel free to put it away now. Say, Spade, have you ever used a smartphone before? Blah, 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 blah. Yes, I have. Very good. And this should be a breeze for you. In fact, these Nook phones are rather easier to operate than ordinary phones. Oh yes, we've simply removed most of the features. Is there no escape? Can I not call for help? I have one more thing for you. Oh, it's your itemized bill. See, I, I saw this coming. This includes everything. Airfare, accommodations, labor, tax, and of course your Nook phone, hmm? Bring your grand total to the modest sum of... as much as my soul is worth. For the getaway package, you can pay your fees with miles instead of the standard bells. I call this extremely helpful service the Nook Mileage Program. Cool. Nook? Like Tom Nook. So the bottom line is, you'd need 48,800 bells to pay your move-in fees, but with this newly new service, would you believe it, it only comes down to 5,000 miles. How convenient. 
I'll just go ahead and register you so you can pay in miles. Yes, yes, but there are more details available with your Nook phone. Just open the Nook Miles app. You'll see that you've earned some miles just for traveling to the island and joining the program. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must get back to a few other matters. Like making my slaves massage my feet and my very bushy tail. Boop. Alright, you're enrolled in the Nook Mileage program. Alright, yeah. Debt hole miles. Beautiful. There's even Tom Nook in a little hat. Nintendo? Oh my gosh, it's my closest friend, Nintendo. Alright. What did I get? What did I get? DIY workbench. Um. Oh, <gasps> the silent life is perfect now. Alright, guys. Uh, I'm gonna end it off here. If you like this stuff, hit subscribe. Uh, more content stuff. I love these maracas.